Well, I'm uh, Larry with Other World Computing, and I have with me uh, David Rosenthal, the uh, musical director and uh, keyboardist for Billy Joel. Good to be here. I've been a, a, a long-time user of our products, and actually I think one of the coolest things is you know, how you use our technology in your show. You know, we, we build all these great things, but it's really up to you know, customers like you. I was designing a system to use when we, when we were gearing up about six years ago now to uh, bring my uh, keyboards into the next generation. And I used to carry around lots and lots of modules and, uh, and uh, at the racks and racks of stuff. And uh, uh, with the advent of main stage and, and everything running, able to run inside a computer, now all of a sudden I'm able to, uh, to have all of my sounds running inside of a Mac and able to run them in real time and access them on, on stage. I needed to be able to stream fast enough to keep up with my uh, playing, with the demands of the system, because I, I build my sounds in layers and it's very demanding on, on, on the instruments that I'm playing and they're all coming from software. So I needed to rely on streaming and, and storage to be quick enough and robust that I could be able to do it in a live environment and rely on it. Thunderbolt came out and Solid State Drives and uh, I came across your products and started using them and, uh, and loved them and uh, kept on uh, growing with it as my needs have expanded for, for more and more um, storage and streaming capabilities and uh, OWC products have just been there all the time for me. I'm actually using not just one, but two of everything because I have two keyboard rigs running in real time so that I have real time redundancy should anything fail. But OWC products, of course not. But <laughs> software, software can sometimes crash. Yeah, backups are very, very important. I yeah. Mean, having protected data and having your, I mean, that's your, you can't have anything go, go wrong live. Right, right, exactly. Yeah, well, you can, but you have to, <laughs> it's how you deal with it. Because, sure. you know, nothing is perfect and, 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 and things do happen. But having the re real-time redundancy allows me to control it from the stage if something even gets weird. I've never had a problem. Uh, for, with any of the hardware from uh, OWC, and I'm not saying that just because I'm here in an interview. It Appreciate happens to that. be true. <laughs> you need to be able to adapt to different situations. Absolutely. Adjust to you know unforeseen circumstances and. Right. There's a really cool program that, uh, that's that's uh, now part of Main Stage. It's called Auto Sampler. So I can use that to sample my and create uh, software instruments of my old uh, synth modules, of which I have stacks and stacks and stacks of them, all these vintage things. Uh, Billy Joel's music spans 30 years, and all through the years that he kept on putting out albums, he would constantly be using whatever was the coolest, newest, greatest synthesizer of, of that time. So my job is to capture that, all those sounds throughout all those years without having to drag around truckloads of gear to replicate it. So I, so I have all of it, and I've, and I've captured it all into software instruments. Um, and uh, so that's when the writing comes in, is while I'm creating the instruments. But during the performance, everything is streaming. You just need absolutely consistent, unfettering read speeds that right. deliver stream and no hiccups. Exactly. I have control of the system and it's fast enough such that once I'm in a performance environment, I can enjoy performing and focus on having a good time and doing the show and then and, and, and knowing that the, the technology is going to keep up with me. I really enjoyed it. I actually had the opportunity to see a show too and I have to really enjoy watching it and you can tell everybody up there, especially yourself, everybody's smiling and having a good time. We really are. It is a lot of fun and uh, we're not faking that part. Not right any on. part actually. I don't think you have. <laughs> I was going to say. No, it's, it, it really is a lot of fun. The songs are great and uh, and they, they do, you know, I just never get tired of them. His music is, is fantastic and I, I really enjoy playing it. It's genuinely fun. Uh, to do every show, but it's so much easier now and so much more reliable. And um, because it's reliable, that's why I can have fun during a show. And you can put the put the energy in other creative uh, processes. Exactly. And the next album. Right. <laughs>